I'm Rob McCoy of RAM Communications, and welcome back to Telecom 101. In this segment, I'm going to show you how the MaxUC application from our partner Access One will make you more productive, whether you're at the office, you're out on the road with your smartphone, or you're doing everything through your desktop. So, without further ado, let's take a closer look. For purposes of our demonstration today, what I've done is I've put together the desk phone. I have my app that's on my, I'm using an iPhone, but if you have Android, this works just as well. So whichever smartphone you have, you can use the app there. Yeah, this just gives you an idea of what the uh, application looks like. It's, it's easy to use. You've got a contact list. You've got a dial pad. I can dial right from the smartphone app. And like other smartphone apps, when I use this, the caller ID for my business is being broadcast to the caller, not my personal cell phone, which is a nice thing for privacy. Here on my desktop, the application that we're using again is called MaxUC. This is a proprietary application developed by our partners Access One in Chicago. And um, it's based on soft switch technology. And this works great. So let's just take a look at how well it works. So for purposes of this demonstration, I have enabled inbound calling on all of my devices. That means you're going to see a call to the desktop. You're going to see a call coming into the desk phone, as well as the smartphone application. In this demonstration, I want you to keep in mind that I have enabled inbound calling on all three of my devices. Normally, you wouldn't do this. If you're here at the desk in your office, then the software allows you to utilize any or all three devices. But again, if I'm using a desk phone, I probably want calls to just ring to my desk phone. With this application, I can turn off inbound calling on my other devices, so I'm only receiving calls on one device at a time. Again, for this demonstration, I want to show you what this looks like when you receive a call to any of the devices. Here we go. Thank you for calling the RAM communications demo. For the de I dial my extension. I'll connect you. So my desktop app window pops up. I press the green button to accept. And I have my call. That's my hold button. Here's my transfer key. And now I can transfer my call to another party. Pretty simple. So you can see that I've left a message in the system. My voicemail button is here on the app and it's telling me I have one message. I click on that message, our web screen pops up and it's showing me I have a message left behind by my company, it tells me the date and time. I click on the message and I have the message recording. For a longer message, the system will transcribe it. I left a very short message. But if you are into transcription and you want that kind of information, this system gives you transcription as well. Before I forget, folks, let me also show you how easy it is to change your presence setting using the desktop app. The app is telling me that I'm online, I'm in the office with a green check mark. If I click on this button, I get a drop menu and I can tell other folks on the system that I'm busy. The great thing about this is I can be here, I can be in Ohio, I could be in Malaysia. If I've got people that are connected in the system all around the world, as soon as I change and update my presence settings, they can see my presence. 
We're hosted, we are unified on one system. If I click on my Do Not Disturb, now I'm offline as far as my team and the outside world is concerned. I go back and make myself available. Now I'm available for calls. One of the biggest productivity benefits of this MaxUC application is the instant messaging tool. There may be folks in the audience that are very used to IM, but for those of you that have not used this tool, this is something you're going to want, and here's why. If Let's say that I'm on a call. I'm on an hour-long conference call, and my colleague Barb just needs to ask me a quick question, or I need to ask her a question, and we need to clarify something. We don't have to interrupt each other. We can be working outside of my call or outside of her meeting, and we can exchange information quickly and easily using IM. This is my instant messaging button. If I click on that, I get a chat window. I send my chat to the other party, and in no time at all, I'll get a response back. And I can see that Barb's typing. And she says that we've got three. So this is a great tool because, again, if you're super busy in the office and you can't talk with somebody, or, again, you just want to send simple information and get back to other things, I am is a wonderful tool for that purpose. I can attach documents and I can send documents over to folks in an IM fashion. Depending on the size of the document, this can take a little bit more time to get to the other person. Another nice thing about using this document transfer from a security standpoint is that the other party has to accept my file. It doesn't load on their desktop right away, so it avoids interruption as far as your teammates or the other parties are concerned. You can see right now that this is doing a download, and as soon as this gets to the other party, they've got the document. So, again, it's a really nice tool that you can use in conjunction with other things that you're doing and in other ways that you're trying to communicate during a busy day. So very briefly, let me just show you that there are other things that you can do in IM. I'm not going to go into great detail on this, but the history button is a nice thing because you can use the search tool to Really look at your text archives. If there's something important that you need to get from a specific date, I can go in and I can look at those dates and see if there was any important information that I needed from a chat session. Again, if I'm very busy and I decide that we need to collaborate and I need to show something on my desktop, I can start a meeting right off the bat using the meeting button. So I'm not inviting folks right now, but if I want to, boom, I'm setting up a meeting, I'm adding participants, and we can share whatever information we want to, whether we're doing it in video or we're doing it in a screen share. You've got all of this at your fingertips using Max UC. Thank you for your time. I hope that you found this information valuable. If you want more information, please contact us at any time. There's much more that we can show you about this and other products that we support here at Ram Communications. Have a great day and take care.